Good afternoon, Hamara. Um, thank you for being here. How are you today? I'm doing really good. How are you? I'm very well, thank you. Thank you for asking. Um, is it okay just to ask you a few questions? Yeah, of course. So why did you start English tuition? Um, well, I started my English tuition because, um, well, me and my parents, we thought that I wasn't doing too well in English, like as I was in maths. Yeah. Got it. So you felt that you were doing really well in maths and your English level wasn't matching up with that subject. Is that right? Yeah. Got it. OK. And I mean, if you hadn't started English tuition, what do you think might have happened? I think I wouldn't really have understand, understood like um, my English at school. I wouldn't have understood the lessons as well as I do now. Got it. So um, what I'm hearing is that you feel like you wouldn't have understood as much in the classroom. How do you think that would have made you feel? I think I would have felt out of place. I wouldn't feel very comfortable in my mm -hmm. lessons at school. Yeah. And that's obviously not a good feeling to have, right? <laughs> mm hmm. So what have you achieved since starting English tuition? What have you achieved? Because I'm going to say it because I know that you're very modest, but you've done phenomenally well, right? So what have you achieved? Well, I've gone like, um, well, since the beginning of the year, I've gone a lot of higher grades in other subjects like uh, RE, geography, um, history, and also theory and drama and art. Um, oh, wow. I've also achieved like um, higher knowledge of vocabulary mm -hmm. and that helped me do better in uh, languages like German and Latin. Oh, wow. So what you're saying is because you've been focusing on improving your English skills, it's helped you with your other subjects. Were you surprised by that? Yeah, I was surprised since like I didn't know how much other subjects would get better. Like um, English would help me get better in other subjects. Yeah, absolutely. I think I think it is. It's always quite, um, you know, students are always quite surprised by the fact that if you improve your English, as you say, even things like Latin and, and theory and art and drama. So that's incredible. And what yeah. about your most recent English results? I mean, what how did you do in your most recent? Oh, English? I was so surprised by this. Um, we got our results back and I was surprised that I got a nine, a, a grade nine and I had mastered most of the criteria that I had gotten. So. How did that make you feel? I was so excited and I was so happy that I had gone so good because at the beginning of the year, I wasn't as good, but now I'm like way better. Fantastic. And what about your parents? How are they feeling? They were very proud of me and they were really impressed when they had the grade nine. Yeah, no, I, I think you, you deserve it. You work hard, so well done. So excellent. Thank you. <laughs> and then what do you like most about English tuition? Because, you know, sometimes people might feel English tuition isn't for them. But how do you feel about it? What do you like the most well, about it? In my opinion, I like how it's um, in a group mm -hmm. since like um, if you don't know any questions, you don't know how to answer them. Mm -hmm. um, your, the other people in your group will help you answer it and it will be more comfortable and it won't be as awkward. Yeah, that's a great point that you've made there, Hamara. As you say, it's collaborative learning, isn't it? So you're all supporting and helping each other. And yeah. I mean, I guess you kind of answered this a little bit, but how do you find online group tuition then? I find it really fun since like it helps me get more confidence and it makes me less awkward and I get to show socialise with other people in my group. Um, it helps me a lot in English as well. Fantastic. And when you say it helps you a lot in English, why do you feel that it helps you specifically in English? Because I think you're right in what you're saying, but why, why do you feel that? Well, it helps me in English because all of the other people in my group, um, they obviously went to the same tuition and they um, understood the same things I do. So, I, so it helps me in English since I can remember what they, what they helped me, how they helped me. Got it. Yeah. So it's not only just that you've got, you know, the, the tutor's instructions, but you're listening to everyone else as well. And it reinforces it, doesn't it? Is that yeah. what you mean? Yeah. Excellent. Fantastic. And what has surprised you the most about developing your English skills? Um, well, I was surprised that um, when I was developing in my English skills, um, I wasn't expecting how much it would help me in other subjects. Yeah. 
um, I wouldn't, I didn't know that learning all of these other English skills would help me in lessons at school. Fantastic. So it's the how you can implement them and transfer that knowledge to other areas, which is fantastic. And it's great that you're doing that. And I guess then what advice would you give to anybody who's in year seven or about to go into year seven? What advice would you give them? I think um, some of, some advice that I would give people starting year seven is just to try your best to stay calm and um, and collected since it can be really scary for some people. Mm but you just have to stay confident and it won't be bad. Um, I also think you have to remember to stay focused in your studies since you might have some tests that you'll find difficult, but you shouldn't stress about it because you're only in year seven, right? Um, I think, um, well, for me, the year went by really quickly when I started year seven. So it might be the same for other year sevens out there. Yeah, excellent. It can be very daunting because you're starting again a new school and you've gone from being you know the you know at the top of your the, the class or the top of the school in year six to now like the baby of the school really yeah year. um but yeah I think that's really great advice I like that stay calm and as you said remember you're in year seven it's okay not to know things right yeah and I also think um it might be really stressful because you'll start getting a lot more homework yeah. and um it's like really different you might like in in year six you might have not done as much drama or new mm. subjects and like you start doing that in year seven so. yeah absolutely so it's new subjects more homework how do you feel tuitions helped you then to manage that because I think that's a really good point that you've uh, made there Hamara um well it's helped well all of the tuitions have helped me gain more knowledge mm -hmm. um and this knowledge has obviously helped me do my homework sometimes well, most of the time, it's helped me do my homework. And um, I and like when we recap other stuff that we've learned in other lessons, mm -hmm. um, it helps me keep it in my mind. So then when I'm doing my homework, I'll remember it. Yeah, great. So it's a great revision tool then that you're directly able to implement. Fantastic. And I guess the last question, Amara, is what would you say to anybody who is thinking of um, you know, joining Up Level Academy? What would you tell them? I would tell them that um, I'd be glad and all the other people um, in this Up Level Academy would be glad to see you since um, we're very collected and we're, we work together. Um, yeah, I think, I think you'll find it really fun um, being here. Fantastic. Thank you, Homara, for your time. I really appreciate it.